He is the former Royal Marine Commando who led an extraordinary double life as an Irish Republican terrorist. Making bombs for dissidents, Kieran Maxwell went undetected for five years. He constructed a range of bombs, all designed for one purpose, to carry out destruction, harm and potentially visit death on those people he would have, they would have been used against. Maxwell's crimes started to unravel in March last year in County Antrim. A member of the public stumbled across an arms dump in a country park. In May, there was another chance find of a cache in a remote forest. DNA from the buried barrels led police to Kieran Maxwell. Living in Devon, serving in the Royal Marines, he was arrested. Police searches uncovered 19 further separate hides in nearby woodland. There were chemicals, timers, detonators, guns and ammunition. He'd made 14 pipe bombs. Four were used in attacks by the Continuity IRA last year. No one was hurt, but they were designed to kill. Maxwell stole some of the parts from the military. The prosecution said a beating by loyalists when Maxwell was 16 was the catalyst for his Republican sympathies. The judge had no hesitation in concluding he is a dangerous man. Police also found lists of people and locations for potential attacks. In total, just over 300 targets. Uh, targets of both named individuals, uh, people, places and locations and institutions ranging from judiciary, military and police, both here in the UK, uh, both here in, sorry, in Great Britain uh, and in Northern Ireland. It was a monumental betrayal by a serving Royal Marine and police acknowledge some of the weapons Maxwell constructed may still be out there.